वेलकम बैक गाइस टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शो शो यू हाउ यू कैन कॉन्फ़िगर फाइल इंटेग्रिटी मॉनिटरिंग फॉर विंडोज एंड पॉइंट इन वाजू व्हाट इज फाइल इंटेग्रिटी मॉनिटरिंग इट इज द सिनेरियो बाय व्हिच यू कैन मॉनिटर योर एंड पॉइंट्स फाइल्स फोल्डर्स drives that who is accessing those drives someone try to add a new file delete a previous file or try to create a new file the wazu will record all these events you simply have to go to the wazu website go to this this user manual scroll down and go to this file integrity monitoring and then you can see how to configure the fim module how to configure the file integrity module so we just move towards the installation uh, from here we can see how we can configure any directory or file in the endpoint the file integrity monitoring always configure at the endpoint you have to just file get the file path and the name of the monitor file or the name of the directory add the following line following setting to the wazu agent configuration file replacing the directories values with your own file path on the linux you can do this way or on the windows you can go by done the configuration by going to this path and for the mac operating system you just have to go to this path and configure in which tag you have to specify the path the tag name will be the sys check and it will be closed like this after this you just simply have to restart the wazu agent so let's move towards the configuration this is how you can access this oz.configuration file you uh, if you are on the windows based agent you would simply have to go to this pc go to the c drives on which the operating system is installed uh, by default you have installed the aju uh, ozek agent on that drive or go to that drive you have installed the ozek agent i have installed the ozek agent on my c drive i simply go to this pc then i will then i go to the c drive then i go to the program files folder and then i have go to this ozek agent folder when you have access the ozek agent you simply have to find this ozek file ozek dot configuration file this is the extension or the type you can see simply you have to double click it and open it now we have to find a sys check tag okay you can see that the file integrity monitoring is not disabled no disabled no means it is enable if you find yes you have to type no here to enable this frequency frequency that sys check is executed as default every 12 hours what is the frequency the frequency is the time set the agent will send the logs to wazu server by default this frequency is set to be on the 12 hours after the 12 hours the wazu agent will send all the file integrity uh logs to the wazu server how you can verify uh, uh 
what is the time or how this can be the 12 hours time set simply go to the calculator we have 12 hours here and every hour has 60 minutes we will multiply 12 by 60 and every minute have 60 seconds we will multiply 60 to this and this is the value 43200 is the frequency time set the wazoo agent will send the logs to wazoo server after 43200 seconds we will set this frequency to the 5 seconds because we want to receive the logs in real time right these are the these are these were the default directories to be monitored by default in the wazoo agent uh, we will configure a directory for for our according to our requirement these are the registries by default which were monitoring and these are the registries and trees to be ignored so what we do we will specify our requirement okay I have created a directory or the folder which one I want to monitor on my windows host. this is the drive name and this is the folder which one I want to monitor so I have tried this script or copy this script what this script will do because we have the we have this script uh, a little different than this it will monitor a file or it will move a, it will monitor a directory what this will do it will check all the directories or folder in a single folder report changes yes in the this is what in the real time and this is our path and this is the tag close so what we are going to do we are going to paste this script in our wazoo agent file and we will save this script now the next step is what you have to do you have to restart the wazoo agent to take the changes place we will just restart the agent if we have any error in the script the agent will not get restarted so now let's move to our wazoo agent we will go to this integrity monitoring here no any uh, event or log take place let's just create a file here or the folder here wazoo test we have created a text file here let's see the log will be appeared in the wazoo or not will take five seconds to get appeared in the wazoo okay let me check maybe we have the error in our script uh, we can apply the filter
we are unable to receive the law let's just check we have frequency and we want to monitor that directory let's just find the error here were no no error in the script it it just take a time to receive the log in the wazu server i haven't changed anything i will show you again this is the script we have copied we have checked all status yes report changes yes year time changes yes and this is our file full uh, drive and the file folder name directory name so you can see this is my wazu agent a file has been added and deleted as well why it is deleted because we have change the file name that's why it it is showing deleted here we have created the file on the j drive in the files folder new text document it has been added then it has been deleted because we have changed the name of this text file this is how you can implement and configure wazu file integrity monitoring or your windows on your windows based host and these are the simple steps by which okay we can test it again like we are going to delete this let's see if we receive the log or not it will take a bit time to show the log in the wazu server i will create an other file here i will create the folder now folder let's see it will yes it is the registry change because we have implemented the uh, we have changed the frequency now it will start sending to the sending logs to the wazu server after every 5 seconds these are the registry logs which were monitoring by default in the wazu agent configuration yeah this was this was the log we have earlier created or oh, the fa the text file was u text agent now it is showing the log that someone has deleted you can see the every aspect of the log this is my used a username and everything you want to to monitor that's how you can configure file integrity monitoring on any of your wazu agent based on windows in the next video i will going to show you how you can do this for uh linux based host now it 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 has start and start sending bulk of logs of wazu of windows registries and file integrity monitoring thank you for watching friends stay tuned please like and subscribe my channel hope you guys like this video thank you for watching